This year, the Forest History Center in Grand Rapids began a lecture series that runs during the winter months through April. As part of the series, they recently hosted Allison Barda, who presented the lecture on the hunt for Northwoods butterflies. Reporter Charlie Yeager has more. Allison had loved butterflies as a child. But her passion returned when she became a science teacher. I decided you need to be able to show your students that you're working on a scientific project and I discovered that uh, I could take really good pictures of butterflies and I thought that would be kind of a cool project. I'm going to try to prove that every butterfly that scientists say live in the Bemidji area or northern Minnesota are really here and so I decided to call it On the Hunt for the Northwoods Butterflies. With more than 90 species living in northern Minnesota, it was essential she create a process to find them all. My best reference is I have this field book called the Butterflies of the Northwoods by Larry Weber. There's a little map for each species and it tells you where they live. That's called their range. And so what I did is I went through Larry's whole book and figured out which butterflies are in the range of the Bemidji area. And then I started the hunt. She also knows the best time of year to find the winged insects. As soon as spring is coming, as soon as you get temperatures that are over 50 degrees, I picked different observation places where I know that I see butterflies, and I go there every day. I have a notebook. I write down which species I find at which observation sites. I also put down, are they male or female? What are they doing? What's going on with them? So um, it takes a little bit of time. At each spot, I have to write down all that information. In her time spent hunting the butterflies, she's taken over 41,000 photos. But that's easy to do when there's so much to see. I know we all love the monarch and we love our Canadian swallowtail. And there's certain species that you know we see, but those are big butterflies. There's a lot of really tiny ones that are only an inch big. And I would just like people to stop and look. Butterflies are magical. Um, they're beautiful. They seem to be around you just when you need something nice to happen to you. Some people say butterflies are people who have passed away coming to visit you. Um, butterflies are just wonderful creatures. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Charlie Yeager, Lakeland News. Allison is now retired from teaching and nearly 12 years after she began hunting, she only has three butterflies left to photograph to complete her collection. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.